I think that's it. Done. And we're good to go, right? Let me know if I missed anything. Please. Please. Leave a comment down below. <laughs> Hashtag riot. Why? Why are we rioting? Oh, because of the blind playthrough tag? <laughs> Twitch, is, they're always changing stuff without telling you. That's like, that's like Twitch's trademark. That's their trademark. They wouldn't be Twitch unless they did things without telling you. Hey, we got mid-roll ads. Hey, surprise! Surprise! Hope you like it! <laughs> Hi, Rule. Hey, welcome back. Uh, welcome in. It's nice to meet you. Uh, hope you're having a great weekend. You caught me in the middle of a semi Twitch rant, but it's not really. I don't really rant. I don't really rant here. I only got love. Only got love for the game. Um, all right, let's turn down this music. It's too intense. Let's turn on Marvelous, another Treasure Island music. I'm very much enjoying this game. I'm going to be sad when it's over, but the show must go on. We have to see what happens at the end. They never expected no one would like it. <laughs> they think everyone would like everything that we do. They love Twitch. They will love, they will love these changes. Okay, so 119, there we go. What are we doing now? Oh, they didn't even give us a choice of where to start. Let me try something here. I removed, oh, the filter is on. Okay, I thought I removed it. Okay. Now we'll just leave it like that. It's usually better with that filter on. It's not really a filter, it's like a, um... It just kind of cleans it up a little bit. I sometimes think social media pages uh, deliberately make the worst changes possible while keep still keeping the sites functional. It feels like that sometimes, doesn't it? So we're here. Oh man, we gotta put the other guy back again. What we were what were we doing last time? Like we found like three oh right, we we were in the forest. We we're about to fight the spider, I think. The Twitter fleets? <laughs> what do you mean Twitter fleets? I don't understand. Horrible changes that Instagram makes. Yeah, I don't know if I like the way they did the messenger. Like the DMs for Instagram now, it's like kind of weird. See, as a photographer, you hate trying to get something to look right on Insta. Fleets are the new Twitters that disappear. Oh! Are those the things that in the app, like on the top with the... I thought, wait, those are like videos, right? The one on the top, they're trying to be sort of like, like Instagram, right? You could do a video and then they disappear. Snapchat for Twitter. <laughs> Instagram also has Snapchat. <laughs> but they last 24 hours. How long do the ones on Twitter last? I n I've never used it. I have never even used the one on Instagram. I should. I should be using it, but... Ready to rumble! Uh, Rupu in the box, thank you for the follow. I appreciate that. Let's see, when did you boys escape? Very odd, okay. So I think we are talking about the same thing. The thing that's on top. On top of the app, when you... When you look at the app. Alright, so... 
I do need Dion. I don't think it matters who else I bring. Hmm. I think I'll leave... I think I'll leave, um, Jack in here. What? Tom! Yo, thanks for the host! <laughs> What's up, Shinkaido? Welcome in, Ashen Circle. Oh my god, a subscription. You guys broke my alerts. Oh, there it is. There it goes. All right, you guys ready? Yo, I'm about to drop a funky dope rhyme. For... That's it. That's the end of the song. Oh my gosh. Uh, there's a couple of... Ashen Circle, thank you for the resub. Three months. I'm about to drop another. About to. Uh. Uh. Yeah. <laughs> Yo, I'm about to drop a fucking dope rhyme for Tom. Thank you for the 22 months of. That's it. That's the end of the song. Of support. That is the end of the song, unfortunately. Thank you guys. Chaos Com, what's up? Welcome in, Flan Duke. Um, Chaos, uh, busy, busy Kenneth. Duke Live, welcome in. Silver Fox, Tai Chi, welcome in. Jesse, good to see you. Gorker, what's up, guys? If you guys don't know already, you guys should be following Retrograde Tom. He is one of the awesomest retro streamers out there. Please, please give him a follow if you aren't already. I'd, I'd be surprised if you're not. I'd be, I'd be totally shocked. Don't t don't tell me that you you're not following him. Chameleon. Thanks for the sub. Yo, I'm about to drop a funky dope rhyme. <laughs> Thank you so much, Chameleon. That's it. That's the end of the song. Thanks for supporting me three months. That is amazing. Thank you so much, Chameleon. Hey, guys, you missed it. I was doing an art stream earlier. I was doing art. I drew. I drew this thing for Saxo. Uh, you, so one of my redeems is you can redeem a doodle if you have enough. Um, I just got up and stretched, uh, Captain Squeaky. But thank you, thank you for redeeming that. I do need to get up sometimes, and that's a good reminder. Thank you. Um, uh, here, I'll show it to you. I can't really uh, cast it to the screen anymore, but um, let's see. Is this a little bit better? No, not really. But here, it's Asterix and Obelix, but I drew them like doing the, um, the X-Men, Cyclops, I mean, uh, Colossus, sorry, Colossus and Wolverine fastball special. Uh, uh, you can't really see it to appreciate it, but believe me, it looks really rad. I'm very proud of it. And I think it came out really well. Yeah, <laughs> I drew them in my style too. I didn't draw them like the cartoony way. I made them a little bit more comic, comic-y, comic book-y. But um, yeah, if you guys don't know me, I play a lot of retro games. I also do art apparently. <laughs> but um, uh, yeah, I appreciate the raid and I appreciate you guys coming in on the raid. It's good to see you all. I'm playing this game called um, Marvelous Another Adventure Island. It's it's a really cool, uh, pretty unique game on the Super Nintendo. Came out in 96, but it never left Japan. And um, I'm playing a fan translation of it. Uh, only one emote left that you wanted. <laughs> it's your first time here. You be quiet, Jess. You be quiet. It's nice to see you here, Jess. Um, I'm going to give a shout out to Jess too. You guys should also be following Just a Kid. Yes. Yes, too late. I did it. Too late. More like yes, yes, the kid. Oh wait, why did the other guy follow me? Ah. Alright, I need to leave one of these guys behind because we're supposed to be in prison. Uh, only two of us are allowed out at a time. Soup's on. Silver Fox, Tai Chi, thank you for the follow. Greatly appreciate that. <laughs> what? 
what? Still flight. Bum, 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 bum. Thank you for the follow. I appreciate that. Welcome in. Welcome in, guys. So our quest right now is we're supposed to be finding like these uh, these five items in the forest. And uh, once we find them, we got to bring them back. And they're going to create something called the Ant Buster, I think. And um, let's see, we already did the switch. I think we're going to go fight a spider now. We got challenged by some spiders in the for forest. So the weird thing right now is that we're shrunk down. It's like, honey, I shrunk the kids right now. <laughs> and we gotta be careful. Gotta be very careful. I, and I love it. I love it so much when they do things like this in the games. When they make you like really tiny or they make you really large. You know, just like mess around with scale. So we're tiny now and there's like these... There's like these giant ants invading the... They're not really giant ants, I think. I think they're like normal size ants, to be honest. I think the kingdom shrunk down is what happened. And we helped that frog already. There's so much that forward. Prepare to be flan. Thank you for Keep the 300. The train moving. Keep the train moving. Thank you for the 300 biddies. I can't believe you guys are doing the hype train. What are you guys doing? Why is that happening? Like Napoleon level from Psychonauts. Captain Squeaky, I still have to play Psychonauts, to be honest. R Ruter. Rutier. Thank you for the 51 biddies. The Shamrock biddies. Fancy. Thank you for the good luck, biddies. So we got like three... I think we got three out of the five ingredients. The fourth one is going to be the silk that we get from the spider, I think, when we defeat him. I still don't know how to defeat him. And then there's like these things. Alright, so the unique thing about these games is you have action adventure stuff going on. It does use... you know, you might look at this and think it looks similar to Link to the Past. That's because it uses the same game engine. Let's see, uh, remember when you were a kid, you loved the giant level in Super Mario 3? Yes! Yes, exactly! Blew your mind, right? Blew your tiny kid mind. Your tiny mind couldn't, couldn't handle it. You just like turned it off and like took a breather for a while and ate some milk and cookies and then came back to it. I mean, that's what happened to me. So there's also like these point and click things. So you can like, you could point and click on things to find out more about them. Or, you know, you could also collect items and then um, the different kids have their own set of items. So they each have their talents and stuff that, that are needed at certain times. You could split them apart and accomplish things or sometimes you have to get them together to do teamwork <laughs> no because you're you're a tiny you're a tiny kid that's what i meant you're a tiny kid and you had a mind that got blown that's what i meant oh gosh these guys talk to mino 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 translate the rumble translation two kings Thank you for the follow. Welcome in. Greatly appreciate the follow. Wonderful Flan. Yes. No, I don't bully Flan. Flan bullies me. You should you should see Flan bully me sometimes. He's he could be a bully too. See tiny <laughs> Flan made fun of my glasses. Alright, let's see. Just who would you be? The Captain Squeaky bullies me? No, you don't. You're nice to me for the most part. Let's see, um... Just who would you be? And why did you stop my brilliant dance? You're the- you could have been talking while you're dancing, I mean... I didn't stop you dancing, that was your decision. <laughs> don't- don't bully me! 
No bully. That's what Todd just said. What? Hey, what's up, Death? <laughs> Welcome in. It's good to see you, Death. Hope you're doing well. Welcome back. How are you? How are you, man? Let's see, so um, mark that thing as complete. All right. And why did you stop my brilliant dance? What pressing business prompted you to interfere? Why are you calling my tiny? I did not. I did not just. Mino, 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 Mino? Oh, Mino, no. You want my beautiful coat, don't you? I'm not gonna lie. I do, I do like the coat. I think it's pretty. I, I kind of want it. But I need it for the ingredients. Well, sucks to be you. <laughs> what a jerk. I wouldn't even let you touch it with them grubby little mitts. Wow. Now who's bullying? I feel like I'm getting bullied here. Tiny Minds and he has the big one. <laughs> I mean, basically Mensa. Alright, so... Click on this. Mino, 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 me. Around and round, around we spin. When you're around, I feel I'll win. Are you challenging me to a spinning contest? Because I'm really good at that. It's like my secret talent. Me no, me no, no, me no. Two people are basically Metsa. <laughs> Exposed. Oh my gosh, I got level one hype, hype trade emote. Thank you so much. Let me click on this thing before it disappears. I got the hype kick. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know what that is. <laughs> Why am I kicking down a door? Uh, I think I like it. I'm not gonna lie, I think I like the kicking door thing. Can I put a face next to it? Will it look cool? I don't think it'll work that way. I've never gotten the kick through the door thing. And that thing is cool too, the the uh, new uh, twi Twitch bit reward things. 2020 gift. Some of them are all right. They're way better than the hype, <laughs> the hyper whatever they were. Hyperscape is that what the game's called? Something like that, right? Hyperscape. I don't play hyperscape. I don't understand. But if my coat gets dirty. Thank you for the follow. Uh, let me see if I get it right. Caesar Britannicus. Welcome in. Rooter. Oh, man, you got some good emotes. Hype what? Oh, some of them are all right. Yeah. I like those. I like those a lot. The ones that you posted. The electricity one is pretty rad. But the shield, the shield is pretty good, like if you're defending against a raid or something. I have the book one. They do, they mostly suck. But some of them are well done. I don't know what I would use the book for, but it's a, it's a well done book. Ashen, what do you have? The kick and the, the defense one? The electricity one is probably the best one out of those out of the group of the uh, ones you've posted. And what's up, TJ? How are you? How are you doing, man? Hope you've been well. I know you've been playing um, Broken Sword. Oh, no, you beat it. You beat it the other day, right? What are you playing these days? They're not bad quality, just things you would never use. Yeah, like they're good quality, but then it's like you don't know what you would use them for. For sure. Let's see. So this guy doesn't want his coat to get dirty. I beat Broken Sword on Thursday. Very busy but eating pizza. I'm gonna have some pizza later. I have some leftover pizza. Sega CD games. Mega Everdrive. Um, I'm playing on this on the Mister, and um, Mister can also do Sega CD. Just saying, TJ. I'm not. Not comparing, I'm just saying I also have the ability to play um, 
Sega CD games, and they are great. You're right. Like, everyone should play some Sega CD games. Um, I played through Popful Mail. TJ, you should play Popful Mail. What else? What else have I played? I have some, I have some, uh, lined up. Soon, soon I'll be playing some other ones. Yeah, Popful Mail was a, was a pretty good one. I think I played another C Sega CD game. I can't remember what it is now. Um, hold on. Let me let me be right back. I gotta take care of my nose. My nose is doing a runny thing. Hold on. <laughs> what? <laughs> hey, hey! I'm back from wiping my nose to say, raid alert, raid alert. Ryan, what is up? How are you doing? Everyone go follow Ryan. One of the coolest streamers out there. You guys should follow him. He's, he's always doing like some really cool stuff. Um, one time I saw him playing with this motion, like this motion sensor for the PlayStation where you like kick and punch. I forgot what it's called. I'm just, I'm just going to call it the Ryan AVX Octagon. He was playing with the Ryan AVX Octagon, See, and he was like doing these punches and kicks. Atomic, thank you for the follow. Welcome in. Yeah, you you almost never get a chance to host me. <laughs> but uh, thank you so much. That is not the only reason you did it, Ryan. It can't be. It's it's for for all all the streamers that you watch that come on later. Later for you guys. But yeah, um, I'm playing this, uh, but yeah, so everyone go follow Ryan, first of all. Secondly, uh, welcome in, I'm Tonda. I play a lot of retro games. I'm playing this weird one called Marvelous Another Venture, Another Adventure Island. And it's a really cool adventure game. It has a mix of different adventure elements, action art, action adventure stuff. Kind of like, you know, think a little bit Legend of Zelda-ish, but no combat. Well, actually, there is combat. There is combat, but you, you use things like baseballs and stuff. So it's a little, I think it's like, to me, it's sort of, it's sort of, um, it's sort of mother, like mother style. Um, <laughs> I don't know. I don't know why I'm blanking on the American name. Mother, the mother series. Um, but anyways, it's sort of like that, that kind of charm mixed with, you know, action adventure. So it's not an RPG, but, um, it's going great. I did a drawing earlier today, Ryan, in the stream. I did some drawing. Uh, I can show it to you. Earthbound. Thank you. I don't, I don't know why. I was like thinking it starts with an E and then I, I couldn't think of it for some reason. But I drew Asterix and Obelix. And it's going to be hard to show you. But uh, when I was drawing it, it was actually capturing from my iPad. But I no longer have that set up anymore. So uh, this is all you get. I could probably zoom in on myself here. Nope, that's the wrong one. You, you guys remember that guy from Super Friends? He would go like, Enough Chuck! He would say, Enough Chuck! And then he would go, and Like some kind of weird, goofy sound would happen. And then he would grow like 20 times his size. So here is uh, the Asterix and Obelix. That I drew. It was like a doodle for Saxo. Uh, for his birthday. It was a channel point redeem. So if you guys hang around here enough, you guys, you too can get a, a doodle from me. And I'll send it to him on Discord later. Yeah, I think it came out really well. It, I'm surprised like how well I do sometimes <laughs> on the iPad. It surprises me sometimes. Because I, I struggle a little bit on the iPad compared to my normal uh, drawing apparatus, which is uh, the Wacom 
uh, Cintiq, the the giant the giant screen thing. How many points to get doodled by Tonda? <laughs> yeah, you want to get doodled by Tonda? You want to get doodled by me? <laughs> you get forty. It's it costs forty thousand channel points. Think of the children. There's combat. Yeah, there's a little bit of combat in here. Not really. It's it's wholesome combat. Um, draw me. <laughs> draw you like one of my uh, anime girls. Let's see. Oh, this one's a girl. Interesting. I'm a delicate girl, you know. Happy camping. <laughs> With all due respect, you really make really nice illustrations. Oh, thanks, TJ. Thanks. That, I mean, that really means a lot. Thank you. All right. So this one's a female, at least, but I don't know about the other ones. Me no me no me no me. Translation, around and round, around we spin. When you're around, I feel I'll win. Me no me no me no. Uh, me no, me no, no, me no. <laughs> you too, Les Roth, thank you. Your migraine is getting to you? Oh, crap. Alright, I hope it goes away soon. I hate migraines. I used to get them all the time. You spin me right round, baby, right round. See, but if my coat gets dirty, I'll burst into tears. I'm a delicate girl, you know. Oh, she said the same thing as the other one. Uh, like a recat, right round. Like a rick, like a recat, right round, 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 round. So they they don't want it to get dirty. Let's see if I have anything. No, we need this, uh, golden drop. I wonder if the paint... Do they want paint? I think there should be more adventure games. I mean, it's already too late, but... I wish there were more adventure games in the 16 and 8-bit era. I mean, you could still make some, right? There are, there are people making games for the... Uh, 8-bit, 16-bit consoles all the time still. You know, like homebrew stuff. And uh, some of them are really fantastic. So... Someone out there, please make a, more adventure games for SNES and NES, please, and I will play them. Thank you. Please and thank you. Like, on the NES, I played uh, Princess Tomato in the Salad Kingdom. And that was such a, a charming, unique adventure game. Um, of course, you also have like Shadowgate stuff like that. There's a lot of them on itch.io. <laughs> That's true. That's true. They they have some that you could download, and then you could even play them in emulators and and uh, on things like the Mister or on your uh, flash cart. That's right. That's right, Takanjo. Yeah, Famicom had a ton, but they didn't... Yeah, they didn't port them over, so... Um, I need translations for them, please? <laughs> and why did you stop my brilliant dance? A pressing business prompt prompted you to interfere... Right. Hold on. What if I I used oh I can't use items. Okay. Hmm. I'll put a pin in this. I do need that coat to complete my quest, but I'll put a pin in that. Maybe it'll come to me later. I do need I do know I I need to fight the spider to get the silk. So I'm gonna try. I'm gonna try Dion. The baseball. Hopefully it works because the boxing gloves didn't work. Yeah, I need to play Uninvited and Deja Vu still. 
I did play uh, Shadowgate when I was younger, so I, I might not do that one on stream, but I will probably try the to rumble. the remaster. Lester Roth, thank you for the follow. I appreciate that. It's dangerous to go alone. <laughs> thank you. Detective games on the Super Famicom when the console was on its last years. Yeah, so yeah, this this game that I'm playing right now came out like towards the last years of the console when it was like you know uh, dying out. So um, yeah, this this never got ported, but uh, luckily for me, there there is a fan translation out there. So. Uh, Fairly well done. There are a few typos here and there, but overall, like, I think a pretty good job. I can't really compare because I don't know the actual text, <laughs> the actual Japanese translations, you know? Let's see. Um, I'm the oldest of four spider brothers. How dare you stomp all over my web? I know you're here for this thing on my back. If you think you can take it, give it your best shot. I'm not a pushover like my brothers, so get ready. So I defeated three of his brothers. Uh, the three other brothers. Uh, spider brothers. In uh, challenges like racing. There was like this one where I had to jump and catch gems. And there was one where I had to kick a... Kick a roly-poly <laughs> soccer ball into a goal. And it was... They are they're kind of challenging. Uh, so let's see how we do it here. Oh man. Dang, he went straight for me. Oh! No! Why am I doing so bad now? Come get me. Oh, was that a hit? It sounded like a hit. Oh wait, can oh shoot. I can't, I can't do diagonally. Yeah, that sounds like a hit. Can I grab the silk? While he's spinning like that? I don't think I could do anything when he's doing that. Oh no! That was close. I got lucky. I mean, it sounds like I'm hitting him. I could also go down, down to the bottom to get more tomatoes to heal up. I don't think I could grab the silk because I got hurt last time. Oh shoot. No, I was looking at chat. <laughs> Alright, I'm going down. I'm going to get the tomatoes. Uh, Tante, Tante Club, name of the detective series. Oh, awesome. Hey, if they have translations for those, I would definitely want to play those. Tante Club, hold on. Hold on, let me write it down. Add it to my ever-growing list. You know, I got a I got a key the other day from a, a developer slash publisher. It was uh, hold on. Let me do this before I forget. Famicom Tante Club. Uh, Radical Dreamers prequel to Chrono Cross. Is that an RPG or is that also an adventure game? Radical Dreamer sounds familiar. I may have come across it during my researches. Oh yeah, or you could PM it <laughs> to me, yeah. Sure, I mean if you want to. I'd appreciate it. Portopia must play as well. JB Herald Murder Club. Ranscott! Oh man, Ranscott knows all the ones too. Ranscott, you, you, you PM me stuff. Crystal Dragon. 
Jesus, no bio. Yeah, I, I remember you playing that one. All right, that's about all I could restore in health wise. I need to stay out of the outside. I wonder if there's something more I'm supposed to be doing. Maybe I need... Oh, shoot. Maybe I need the other guy to punch. Sometimes it takes teamwork. Oops. Well, that was a disaster. Oop. No, he definitely doesn't get hurt by punches. Oh no, don't eat me, no! Uh oh. Oh, the other guy died. He camped, he camped right on top of the other guy while I was switching and trying to run away. I was trying to get the other guy to safety because he wasn't going to be any use anyway. So I'll just start from the ship, it's fine. Oh no, they make us do all this again. So, what happens is you don't lose progress, but there's sort of like checkpoints. So whatever you gained, after you die, you still, you still have it. Um, but I just need to go back over there again. I guess that's the punishment. <laughs> yeah, take the walk. I'm gonna, I'm gonna bring this guy this time, see if he's any use. Cause he has the, um, he has the fishing rod. Maybe I could fish it, fish the silk away from the spider. I mean, it's worth a shot. Like while he's like dazed. How you doing, Spider? <laughs> spider Maw. I'm sorry, I have to I have to defeat one of your brothers. Sorry, Spider. I defeated three of them in uh in a friendly in friendly games. But this one I need to actually beat them up. Seems like. Boom <laughs> boom 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 boom. Oh yeah, so the the game I got was um from the publisher uh shoot what, what was it called? It's uh, it's the mystery dungeon stuff. Um let's See, I need to walk all Oh, I could walk through the water now. I forgot. I forgot it's not electrocuted anymore. Shirin the Wanderer. So, there was one that came out on the Game Boy Advance. No, um, on the DS. Shirin the Wanderer. And, uh, that got ported recently to the, to PC. So I was thinking about playing that sometime. Let's, uh... Alright, we gotta talk through to him again. But I'll put the other guy on standby. Make sure he's set to fishing pole. Doesn't seem like it. Oh crap. No. It doesn't seem like it's doing anything. So maybe it just got to hit him a bunch of times. I'm not entirely sure I'm hurting him though. I mean, no. 
Alright, what's my health? Okay. I think usually when they're hurt, they kind of like blink. They do this like transparent, transparent blinky thing. Doesn't seem to be doing it though. So maybe there's more to it. <laughs> the music in this game is pretty great. This one's a little weird though. I mean, it's, it's boss music. It sounds intense. Oh, man. I think there's something more I need to do, but I don't know. Don't know what it is. Hammer? The other guy could, uh, the other guy could kick. I don't think the golden drop does anything. Oh, let me, um, I always forget to do this. Let me, uh, let me actually point and click on him. I thrashed another human not so long ago. Not even his bones were left. Of all the humans in the world, I evaluate your skills as unrivaled. <laughs> oh, thank you. Is he complimenting me? Right, that's the spider silk. Looks like it may come off. Am I supposed to hit that too? Like, I gotta time it. How do I get it off? Oh shoot. No. I mean the fishing pole was a good idea. Alright, I'm gonna get some health first. It looks like it may come off. Whoops. Oh, maybe I gotta kick it. Maybe I gotta kick it. Alright, let me try the fishing pole again. Oh crap, I got it! Yes, I figured it out! <laughs> nice. I tried it before, Do you guys saw. It wasn't working. A good, a good thing I tried it again. I think I was like trying to toss it like directly onto it though. So maybe I needed to just kind of wait, like uh, reel it in a little bit. So I got the silver thread, nice. Oh, he, he looks pissed off. Let's go talk to him. Fugo, Fugo, Fugu. I lost. Go on and take it. I won't mess with you anymore. Use it wisely. <laughs> He's just spinning around. Yeah, sometimes the bosses take a little, uh, a little thinking, which I actually appreciate. I like the game, the game kind of makes you think a little bit. Alright. Oh, we already did this one. This was the race. 
Okay. So I wonder if the paint... I wonder if they want the paint. Because I don't know what the paint is for. No? Uh, I might have to talk to these guys again and figure it out. <laughs> yeah, he was kind of a... A little bit of a sore loser, but not really. Where did I stop your brilliant dance? Pressing business prompted me to interfere. So what if I touched it with... What if I use something else and I didn't touch it directly? Maybe that's what they're saying. Alright, I'm thinking the boxing guy maybe. guy has again. Hammer didn't work. Oh, maybe the running? Okay. Alright. I'll send the I'll send this guy back and then get the get the green guy again. Good thing we could walk through this water now. Makes it a lot easier to switch out guys. <laughs> Thanks, Lester Roth. So I'm thinking maybe boxing, because they kind of look like... They kind of look like, um... Punching bags. Just hanging, you know, dangling from the ceiling. Sometimes the answer is more direct, like... <laughs> like, uh, punching stuff. Last thing we need. I don't know what the pain is for though. So I'm wondering. I'm wondering what the pain is for. We do know that we could we could blend green and red to make black. We also know that um, green makes you, you need to start with green to make a checkered pattern. And you need to start with red to make a polka dot pattern and blue to make a stripe pattern. Um, we read that from some books earlier. Let's see. Shadow Gate some sort of remake. Oh yeah, that's, I didn't finish saying what I was going to say. Um, yeah, I'm planning on playing the, the remake sometime. Since I did, I did finish the other one as a, you know, when I was younger. Alright, it's doing something. It's doing something. Maybe I just gotta keep doing it. Saying the same thing though. This is the only thing that did anything to them. <laughs> Time to bully. Oh! You actually get hurt. Oh. 
I don't know if this is just some fun thing that they're doing now, or if this is actually what you need to be doing. Is it super cheap now? Yeah, I got it. I got it on some sale before. If I kick it. I couldn't use teamwork, right? We don't even have the entire team. I don't know where else to go. Um... We, we've been everywhere in this... in the forest. Sure. If I keep hitting it. <laughs> I'm actually losing health. If I stay here, I don't get hurt though. Oh, wait. I do. Why wasn't I getting hurt before? Maybe I wasn't I wasn't standing directly. Okay. No, not sure why I'm getting hurt now. Oh, maybe because I was swinging. You got iframes. Yeah. I can't hit it on the rebound though. I, I'm confused too. Hmm. And there's no other clues. Maybe I want it to get dirty. Right? What if I put some, uh, put some, um, honey on it? What else do we have that would be... I tried the paint. Honey on Todd. <laughs> Pour some sugar yeah, on time. me. Schrader man. Thank you for the follow. Welcome in. Couldn't be sweeter. <laughs> I'm hot. Stick your sweet. From my head to my feet. Yeah. I can't do anything. What do you want from me? The drill? You want the drill? Alright, what does the other guy have? Let's look at... Let's look at Jack again. He has a frog's tail, blue paint, silver thread. Salty spray! I totally forgot about the salty spray. Alright, we could try that. That means I have to switch them out. Oh, I should save anyway. Alright, yeah, let's try the salty spray. Maybe they don't like salty spray on their thing. <laughs> but too much, too much EV? Is that too much? Uh, Alright, need to communicate back. Go back to them. Send back. Let's send him back. He's the only one that doesn't do anything there. Wait, put on my shoes. 
Here you go. Speed things up a bit. <laughs> I need to be doing the Naruto run with the arms behind my back. This isn't anime enough. <laughs> oh my god, Eevee. <laughs> Alright. Switch out. Hopefully the salty spray does something. Otherwise I'm sort of out of ideas. Oh, whoops. Too far. Oh wait, wait. How about these places? There we have a shell, two pots, and a chef hat. I don't know what I would use to barter, uh, barter with anyway. I don't think I have anything to barter. I need that, I need that, I need that. This thing right here looks interesting. I can't click on it. Alright, let's leave. This one's a bakery. Yeah, this bakery, it gives you a free mecha toy if you buy caramel. Caramel. But they ran out. They ran out of the bonus toys. Oh, I need the caramel. But how how will I how will I buy it? She doesn't offer She doesn't offer a way to buy it. Hmm. <laughs> Yes, I want to buy some. Give me some. She won't let me buy it. Watch what happens when you step through this. This little kid just starts laughing at you. That scared me the first time. This guy started laughing at me. What a bully. Right, and then there's this uh, toy. I don't think there's anything I could do with this toy. It just gives you information about it. Pretty good quality for a freebie bonus. And then it winds up. <gasps> Wait, I don't know if I've done that before. Look at what you did, you ruined it. You better pay for this, you know. Just kidding, that part falls off all the time. Oh, okay, I guess I did do that before. <laughs> it's an easy fix. Yeah, so that's that's great mecha number three, and there's like two more. Um, there's two other robo robos. I can't do anything to it, can I? Do 
Giga Chan, Giga Chan, shaken. Ba ba boom. Can't do anything with that. I want the caramel. I want to put that on the on one of those on one of those spinny things. But I guess that's not the solution. There's no caramel for me to click on. I don't know. I guess this place is just here for fun. <laughs> I want the caramel. It seems like that would be the solution. Now I can't go into any of these. Oh right, there's the artist guy. And there's this inn. Um, the kids who invaded our kingdom. Are you supposed to be fuddling around here? Customers stop coming around thanks to the blue things. Thanks to the ant monsters. Business is in the pits. Well, I can't fight the ant monsters unless I have the ant buster. If you don't want to be arrested again, stop acting so suspicious. This is the royal painter, Caesar's house. Solomon is inside and they seem to be having an argument. I guess that's where the paint comes in, right? But we have to complete a d another part first, I guess, for that to open up. And they won't let me go through here. I guess after we get the Ant Buster, then we go to the right and there's like other stuff that happens. <laughs> so maybe, maybe I punch it first. And then I used the fishing line to uh, grab the coat. Or the, try the spray. Let me try the spray first. Asleep on the job, eh? Oh, it did something! Yes! Yes! Yeah, what is this? Oh, crap. Is it a boss fight? Can I spray it again? Alright, boxing. Boxing. Switch. Nope. Look at the unimpressed eyes. <laughs> Daytonda! What's up, Barfy? How are you? How are you today, man? I guess we'll go talk to him. Look at the eyes! It's like, seriously? Seriously? You're just gonna beat me up and take my coat? You know what these things remind me of? The things from Sesame Street that go, yep, 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 uh-huh, uh-huh. You know what I'm talking about? Yep, 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 yep. The things with the big mouths. How could you have done this? This, this was my favorite. Are, are there people inside or is that just what they look like? Mino, 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 no. So it is an animal because that's the way animals talk. They have like different, they, they speak kind of like that. So it's some kind of animal. It's not like a person inside a coat. The weird spinny thing is unamused. It totally is. You did overtime? Aw oh, man. Yeah, I hope you find some time to chill and relax. Oh, you're gonna, ch you're gonna switch jobs. Well, yeah, good luck, Barfy. 
Yeah, man, you're, it seems like you're working all the time there, like overtime all the time. So yeah, maybe it's maybe it's for the best. But I wish you luck, man. Uh, remind you of weird pine cones. They do look like, like pine cones, but they're like kind of fuzzy. I don't know what they're supposed to be. Most things that we've run into have have been like some kind of animal or or a uh, or insect, especially in this forest. So I, I have no idea. Just take it away from me. I want it out of my sight. We got the forest coat. We got all five items. Yes. Progress. We don't understand that bug's sense of fashion. What, what is he? Wait, what is he? What is this? Is that a... What kind of bug is this, guys? Professional waffle stomping? What? I like waffles. I don't like them to be stomped though. I, I like waffles though. Fresh waffles. Let's see. Uh, Over time for like two months straight. Give you cash to chill for a bit while you plan your next maneuver. Oh, nice. Well, that's nice of them. Yeah, I totally bullied them into getting the coat, but I have no idea. <laughs> I have no idea what this insect is. It looks like he's laughing now. I should talk to it. Yeah, it's some kind of bug. It's bugging me that I don't know what it is. Me no, me no, me no. Unless I get another coat soon, I'll catch a cold. Oh, his head is moving because he's cold. That's what's happening. At first, I thought they were chrysalis, right? Like, th that they were gonna change into butterflies or moths or something. So unless I get another coat. Alright, catch a cold. Anything will do, so don't... Uh, won't give... I can't read. Anything will do, so won't someone give me a new coat? Okay. What happens if I do find a coat for him? Like what do we have that we could even give them? I don't I don't think we have anything. Well, let's go back. We did it. Mission accomplished. We'll just leave him in the cold. <laughs> Maybe that's just the conclusion. Maybe he just ends up being cold like that for the, for the rest of his life. Bagworm larvae. Are those oh mochum? Are are those are those fuzzy? The bagworms? Are they are they fuzzy when they when they have a when they're in larva form? It's interesting. Alright, we're headed back. Victory is ours. You pull the guy out of jail and then and then talk to the, the scientist guy. And then we'll see what we need to do next. Yay! Got the boys back together. Choose who you will leave behind. But I have all the items. If you drag your feet, the blue things will come and destroy us. The one who stays behind must stand in the middle of the cell and let... Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Okay. Maybe I need to look at this thing. Uh, the five ingredients of the ant buster. Uh, 
I have all of them. Who do I talk to? Maybe the king? Let's go see if the king's there. I thought Hassan was in charge, but it turns out he still thinks we're supposed to be in prison, even though we have all five items. We got the golden drop. We have the shell, the tail, the silver string, uh, silver thread, I mean, and the forest coat. So we should be good. Oh, they're not back. Oh no, I don't know who I'm supposed to talk to. It's a bagworm. Oh, if you want to post it in chat, you could post it. Post a picture. I'll take a look at it. The king is taking a little nap. Don't make a ruckus. Solomon is running errands in town. He probably at the artist. All right, maybe we need to talk to Solomon. We'll go to the artist house. <laughs> That's no moon. Oh, we can't even leave the... We can't leave here. So we're stuck in here. So we can't see Princess Polly. <laughs> oh, that's where the Talks Like a Sissy came from. There was this quiz that we had to take earlier to earn one of the items. And uh, one of the questions was, who talks like a sissy? And there were like three choices, and I, I didn't know it was Solomon. He's one of the best real warriors in the kingdom. I totally forgot that the, this guy said that. They have that in Animal Crossing too, the bagworms? Alright, is it gross? I need to zoom out. Oh yeah, they look like them. Oh, it looks, it looks exactly like them. Except for the eyes, right? Where, where's the eyes? All right, here's my, here's what I'm looking at. Wait, it's not showing up. Hold on. Why isn't it working now? Oh, it's in the wrong, wrong tab, maybe. There we go. All right. Yeah, take a look at that. It's totally, that's totally the bagworm. But is that what they look like underneath? They, they look like weird, weird ants? <laughs> Looks strange. The names refer to the habits of caterpillars of these two families, which built a small protective cases in which they can hide. Swagworm, yeah, more like swagworm. Oh, maybe I just used the item on the guy. I didn't think about that until now. Alright, so we talked to him. Alright. There we go. Yeah, use the items. Give him the golden drop. Oh, look at that! A golden drop! Good work! Just a moment. So I could have been giving it to him the whole time. Oh, that's what those machines are in the back. Hey, Mr. Trivia, what's up? Welcome back. How are you today? Yeah, the game one looked a little bit more fluffy, but I think if you're going to do a pixel version of the bagworm, I think they did a pretty good job. They did a pretty good job of that. All right, so um, gave him the coat. Now let's give him the silver thread. I could have been giving them to him the whole time. I thought I needed to get all of them first, but it didn't matter, to be honest. We had enough room in our inventory to carry everything. There are three items left, okay. Frog's tail. Oh, look at that, a frog tail, good work, just a moment. Alright, I'm excited, I don't know what's gonna happen after this. Forest shell. 
This one is Fantastico. No, no problem, Lester F. Um, oh man, that looks so cool. Hold on. Look at this one. It's like a weird spiral log cabin. Look how nice the spirals look too. And there's a, there's the bug underneath, I guess. And it's carrying these this log thing. <laughs> Bugs are weird and fascinating. I love it. Wait, do I have like three OBSs up? What's happening? Oh, never mind. OBS kept crashing on me before I started the stream. And I was trying to set up the uh, the capture for the iPad. It was acting weird. All right. Um, okay, forest shell. I think, is that the last one? Yeah, that, that house looks awesome. All right, one more item. I think Max has it. Oh, the forest coat. There we go. The forest coat. Good work. Just a moment. <laughs> Here we go. Ant Buster incoming. Great. Now I have everything I need to make the Ant Buster. Let's start immediately. The Ant Buster sounds like a, like an anime move. Ant Buster! Or, or maybe like... Yeah, like some kind of anime move. <laughs> OBS still scares you? Once you learn it, it's kind of like, you know, you get comfy with it. But I still get nervous around updates. But for the most part, updates don't break anything. Let's see. Uh, just think of termites, ants, bees, and wasps. They're true architects. Yeah, I love, I love like ants and bees are fascinating to me because yeah they're they're always like they're always working on stuff and they're like a well-oiled machine all right making the power to the max ant buster online okay <laughs> All right, is it coming out? It's looking good. I've spent years researching this, so I'm a little nervous. You boys are free now. Enjoy some sightseeing in our kingdom. I'm very thankful to you. Good work. We did it. We did it, guys. So I guess we're going to go uh, see about the other guy with the with the paint. For some reason, your mind thinks OBS is completely different from slobs. Probably isn't. From what I've seen, there are a few visual differences. And then slobs has like these, these extra features that, you know, has some, some extra features attached to it. Um, but yeah, I haven't really used slobs myself. <laughs> I've always been on the main OBS for a long time now, so I was like, oh, no use changing now. All right, so this is the painter's house. Oh, it's open now. Okay. Oh, I should save. It's been a while. Oh, he's painting the king! Caesar, or whatever his name is. The only thing left is to paint the gown, but I'm stumped. What are you doing? If you do anything suspicious, the soldiers will arrest you again. We have the paint. You guys, you want some paint? 
Wowzers, those are the painting tools Caesar lost in the forest. Go take them to Caesar right away. Nice. Slobs is a CPU hog? I've heard that too. You fired that for regular OBS and stream elements. <laughs> yeah, Avocado, KitKat, I, I just stick to uh, OBS Studio. It does everything I need it to do and it never causes me any trouble. It also, I also uh, added a plugin to do these captions that I don't know if you noticed, but you could turn on captions and captures everything I say and uses like some kind of Google voice to text thing going on. Oh, my, my, <laughs> my phone thought I was that. I was talking about it. All right. Uh, oh, fiddly diddly sticks. At this rate, the king is going to have my head. What should I do? The king's birthday is coming up in only three days time. I need to finish his portrait in time for his birthday or else. But woe is me. I was out on a stroll when all of a sudden, a gang of spiders from the forest mugged me and stole my paints. Mugged you? I can imagine, like, this, these spiders just, like, kind of, like, come from this the top of the forest and just, like, they kind of, like, uh, jump them. And they're like, hey, hey, buddy, what do you got? You got some paints? Give us your paints. Give us your paints. Are you going to get, you're going to get the, you're going to get some of this. Uh, if it can translate, then you can bridge it with Japanese viewers. I, I. I don't think there's a way to do that yet, but that would be awesome. It seems like it would be possible, right? With uh, a like a uh, AI and uh, you know machine learning. But yeah, one day, yeah. I mean, phones could do that with apps, so I don't see why it couldn't. I don't know. Let's see, uh, Forrest mugged me, stole my paints. Oh, what will I do now? Buddy, I got your paints right here. I got your paints right here. Those are the paints I lost in the forest. Thank you for finding them for me. But I'm going to let you go ahead and keep them. What? Free paint. According to my calculations, overlapping two of those paints will finish this painting. The problem lies in which order to use the paints. Oh boy. What 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 pattern and color are we going for? That's what I need to know. Cause I then I could use the um use my knowledge from the books to make the right thing. See my painting know-how is in a book in the castle archives. If you try to remember what the king's gown looks like, you could read the book and figure out how to duplicate it. I don't know what his gown looks like. Do you got? Do you have reference? <laughs> do you have a reference of the king? I need reference. Hmm. I'm gonna take a look at the archives again and see if there are any other books I haven't read yet. But the king is gone now, and I. We haven't seen the king in a long time in in-game time. <laughs> so I can't remember what his gown looks like. Oh, is there a picture of him hanging somewhere? Maybe? Doesn't seem like it. go down here. This painter's an amateur. <laughs> yeah, why does he want us to complete the painting? Why can't he do it himself? How's the ant buster coming along? Right, there's these two books, but I, I didn't see if there are any other books. This one looks like it's sticking out. Do you see this? Oh. It seemed like it. It's a different color than most of them. 
I already read the other ones. Alright, there's no other book here. I mean, I guess I could just guess and then trial and error. But there's there's a few combinations. I know green and red make black. I don't even know if black is needed, but I know how to how to create black. And also red makes polka dot. Blue does stripes. Green does checkered. I remember there's a quiz. There's a quiz question about his shorts. And then his shorts were like. I think they were striped. So maybe it matches his shorts. Try different things. Let's see, Caesar O Nai O Inai. King's portrait for his 50th birthday. The gown isn't finished yet. So red is polka dot. I don't know if we need any blacks. Maybe the color is black, but we also need to figure out the pattern. Let's try let's try green green and red. You can't paint like that. You have to focus and use all three at once. Oh teamwork! Oh my god. Who's gonna paint now? Oh crap. Think of the king's gown and pick the first color. <laughs> paint a dino. Right, let's try green and then red. All right, let's combine our power. Here we go. It's gonna be like a black. What do you think? Chef kiss? Masterpiece? It's pitch black. Didn't you read my painting book? Go and take a breather and try again later. Wow, so picky. What are you doing? I'll fix this, so come back later. Okay. Don't forget to paint two layers. Alright, how long does it take him to fix it? Okay. That was fast. So we definitely don't want green and red. Blue, if I start with blue, it'll be stripes. <sighs> I don't know. <laughs> I don't remember what it looks like. I don't know if there's a picture out there. All right, let's see, um, let's try blue. Blue will do stripes. And green will do checkerboard. I don't know if we want polka dot. Oh no, it doesn't look like it's working. Wrong combination again. Maybe I should read the book again. But I'm pretty sure all it says is 
green and red make black. And then the other one says, if you start with red, you'll get polka dot. If you start with blue, it's stripes. If you start with green, it's checkered. I don't think it says anything else. I don't know what you want from me, man. What's this guy say now? There are lots of documents here. Lots of confusing books in here. I can't figure it out. Perhaps they will mean something to you. Right, guide number one, how to make black. Start with green and then mix with red, you get black. If you start with red or something, you won't get black. Or something? All right, so I'll start with red. Uh, pa patterns. First color you paint determines the pattern. Reds, polka dots, blue stripes, greens, checkers. See, I remembered. I remembered. Out of the, all the things in my life that I could remember, I remembered that. And I forgot everything else. <laughs> Sino! Hey, what's up? How have you been? Oh my gosh, Sino. It's good to see you. Welcome in. Thank you so much for the super kind raid. So it's really kind of you. <laughs> Welcome in. I hope you guys are doing great. Hope you had a great stream, Sino. Welcome in, everyone. Um, who is, who's here? Lasagna for brains. Only metahuman. Wow, only metahuman. Amazing. The James. Welcome in. Welcome in, guys. It's good to see you. How are you doing, Sino? Uh, Arcade. Weisenheimer. I hope you guys had a wonderful stream. What were you up to? Everyone, please go follow Cinematic. Uh, she's an amazing streamer. Uh, very very chill and she plays like some of the some of the like weird games the one that always comes to mind is she was like playing uh um what, what was it <laughs> my brain is fried um she was playing x files she was playing one of those x files games and it was like kind of it was pretty fun to watch did you ever beat that one by the way played all the way through echo night nice it was something. Was it like janky? Was it janky and weird? I think I've seen uh, someone play Echo Knight before, but I can't remember who. Mulder playthrough was rough. Oh my gosh. Yeah, everyone go follow Sino. Uh, she's really cool. Uh, you guys will, will enjoy watching her, I'm sure. Uh, and if you guys don't know me, I'm Tonda. I play a lot of retro games. Uh, currently playing through this this weird looking this weird little game. It's called uh, Marvelous Another Adventure Island. Uh, actually, came out on the Super Nintendo, but I I think most people wouldn't know it uh, because it never came out of Japan. So I'm playing a, a fan translation Soup's of it. On. The James, thank you for the follow. I appreciate it. Welcome in. And um, currently we're we're somewhere near the end. We're near the end now, but I don't know what to do in this one thing. They want us to paint this this coat of the for the uh, for the king. Good vibes. <laughs> this game is like super charming. It's like sort of like a mix of Earthbound with a little bit of Link to the Past. And uh, some weird point and click stuff too. Like it has some point and click things going on, which is really weird for a Super Nintendo game, I think. We don't see that very often. It's janky, kind of boring. Aw, I'm sorry it was boring. Rarely has music. Don't play something yourself, you'll sit in silence. Aw. <laughs> I, I personally have a hard time with games like that. If it doesn't have music and I have to like play something over it. Like when I played Bard's Tale, uh, through all the Bard's Tale stuff, 
there wasn't a whole lot of music, especially like during combat and stuff. And A for effort, what's up? I'm keeping you company while you make apple pie? What? You're making apple pie? All right, so I think we got to start with red. I had some I had some homemade apple pie on Thanksgiving. Um, my niece made it. And it was pretty good. It's pretty good, I have to say. But yeah, if you want to post pics to torture me, you could post it in Discord if for effort. <laughs> I would love to see them. All right. So I, I'm thinking I need to start with red. So this game's pretty neat because, you know, each kid, there's like three kids in your team and you could split them up and they each have their own talents and stuff, uh, different things that they could do. And um, sometimes you need to get them together to do teamwork. Like this, for example, we need to paint together for some reason. <laughs> so we have to use teamwork to do this. And I don't know what the combination is. I think I have to start with red. So it doesn't turn black, right? And then, I don't know, let's, let's try Jack. If it's not Jack, then it's probably going to be Max. Oh no, it's turning black again. I think it's wrong. So you definitely don't start with green. <laughs> I don't know what the combination is. I actually don't know what the what the king's coat supposed to look like. Like I don't remember. We saw him one time when we came into the kingdom, but that was a long time ago. So I'm just going to try to brute force it, I guess. Oh, it's working! Yes! Yes, I think we got it. It's actually doing a color. Please, please be it. No, what? Close, but the design is wrong. All right. So red and green, it did the polka dot. Go clear your head and try again later. Oh my gosh, this guy's brutal. <laughs> Ready to rumble. You're a dear mini talents. Not a girl, thank you for the follow. Greatly appreciate it. Welcome in. Ready to rumble. Yes, nice to see you. Welcome in. All right. So red and blue doesn't work. Red and green worked. Starting with green is wrong. So let's start with blue and then go blue, red, and then bl if that doesn't work, then blue, green. Oh, it's doing something. Oh, it's like a stripe, like a cool stripe pattern. <laughs> I did it! Yes! A weird blue-green rainbow thing. It's beautiful, wonderful, marvelous! He, he said the thing, he said the thing, the title of the game, he said it. This game looks very cute, it is, it's, it's like super charming and cute. I'm enjoying it a lot because of that and the stories and uh, it has some puzzles in it, but the puzzles aren't too bad. They're not too hard to figure out. Um, it's fun. It's a fun game. And just a little bit of trivia for you guys. Uh, this game was uh, headed like the design of this game was headed by A.G. Ayanuma, who if it sounds familiar to you, it's because he's like the guy that's known for the Zelda series now. 
he's he's been doing Zelda games, and, and this game was uh, produced and developed by Nintendo, so he had to start in, at Nintendo, and then uh, now he's like the the head guy for all the Zelda games uh, since Ocarina of Time until now. Uh, and unfortunately, a lot of people don't know about this one, even though this came before Ocarina of Time. Uh, because, you know, it never came out of Japan. <laughs> but a lot of cool design, the little things that happen in the game, you could probably see some of the, some of that stuff in like later games that he does, like Four Swords and stuff like that. All right, so it's beautiful, wonderful, marvelous. That's the king's gown, I remember. Good work. I'll go inform the king, so come along come along afterward. I'm sure the king will be very pleased. That is a pretty dope painting. I mean, look at that pixel art. Look how good it looks. Nice use of colors. Mhm. Mm I like it. The right solution involves seeing King's gown, a way to make it happen. <laughs> Not saying anymore. Oh, okay. I just brute forced it. It's fine. <laughs> I did use some clues to help help brute force it. So I did I did have some way to narrow it down, I guess. Um but that's fine. My way worked eventually. <laughs> yeah, it doesn't matter now, right? Princess Polly will defeat the blue. Go on. Shh. This is a secret from my father. <laughs> They're making a ruckus about it too. Is she not supposed to be out here trying to defeat the the ants? Narrow it down, draw a big clown. That's your motto. Yeah, that's a good that's a good motto. What's she doing? Oh, she has the ant buster. Is she gonna join my squad? Oh, little travelers, I'm glad you're here. The princess is insisting on leading a war party. She wishes to march against the blue things. Can't you stop her? Princess, the ant buster was invented to repel the blue things. I haven't done tests. Diablo, listo. Uh, Ruter, thank you for the follow. I appreciate that. Welcome, welcome in. Hope you guys are, hope you're enjoying this. Uh, I haven't done tests to see if it will kill them. Oh, we don't even know if it works. <laughs> Why didn't he do tests? He has, he has a sample of the blue things like down in the, down in the prison. Why didn't he test it? Hassan, what are you saying? I don't want to just sit here and waste my time waiting to die. If we wait, they'll come again tonight and destroy our kingdom. Hurry up and give me that buster cannon. I understand. If you've made up your mind, I won't try to stop you. I'll stand and watch over the castle and entrust you to Hassan's care. What are you saying? You're coming with me? But, but oh, Princess, wait! Don't forget the Super Buster Cannon! <laughs> uh, I guess we should go follow them. Right? They gone this way? This gate leads to the blue thing colony. Those without king's permission may not pass. Alright, so I guess I gotta get the king's permission. Hey, where's the king? The king is taking a little nap. Something wild was going on back there. What could it have been? Oh, maybe I do have to, like, rile up the king. 
So, I have to make some noise. Some noise, maybe? <laughs> Let me through! It's a secret place that no one except the king, not even Polly, can enter. Oh, maybe I could go to Polly's room. Yeah, yeah. I was just thinking that. Alright, so the guard is gone here because they went on a war party. Wait, is that Solomon? What's going on here? What can I say to the princess to have her forgive me? If anything happened to Princess Polly, I couldn't go on living. Please, you must save her. I can look at the picture. This painting is of Polly's dearly departed mother. Huh. This face... It's Max! It looks just like Max! It looks like the green guy in our team. Why? Are they related? What's happening? What's happening here? Max, explain. What? What? <laughs> what kind of sick joke is this? Yeah, this is Max. This, this guy. Oh my god. Why? Why? Why is your picture there? Is he related? Strange. Um, no, I haven't. What? What is BS Zelda? Lusteroth. See, there's a letter here. Let's move a bit closer for a look. All right. I don't know. Can I? How can I get closer? Oh. Is that one of those randomizers? See, there's a letter. Is that one of those randomizers the kids talk about these days? <laughs> it's all like a weirdo. Dear Solomon, I've gone with Hassan to defeat the blue things. I forced him to keep the secret from you. If I had it, you would have tried to come along no matter what I said. If anything happens to us, please take care of my father. He's hopeless on his own because he gets lonely so easily. <laughs> also, make sure those three boys can safely leave our kingdom. I'll take care of the blue things to restore peace to our kingdom. Don't worry, Polly. My king! It's awful! Princess Polly is... All the Stella View stuff. Yeah. No, I haven't. I haven't played those. Um, I know there's like, there's a a Satella View version of this game. There's like two, two versions of the two other versions of this game, and one of them is the Satella View. Maybe one or maybe both of them are. But yeah, they had like um, some kind of like uh, what do you call that? Where you. Corrupt84 bum, 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 bum. Thank you for the follow. Welcome in. Um, what, what do you call that? When you go on those... Um, you go hunting and you have like clues and you, you have to find like certain items. Yeah, they, they had something like that. Yeah. I forgot what you call those. Oh no, what did it say? Hold on. I missed the thing that it... 
the, what the other thing said. Mm, 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 mm. Well, it's not going to do it again. I guess I just got to leave. Scavenger hunt. Thank you. <laughs> My brain is not working today. Thank you so much, Corrupt. Save the day. MVP. So I guess that letter just triggers it. Uh, is the king back? The music changed. Oh, man. Princess Polly's assault team was annihilated. What? Worse yet, she herself was taken prisoner. Oh, we gotta go save her. Even with the Ant Buster, they came on us in swarms. We never really stood a snowball's chance in hell. Wow, this music is, is really awesome right now. How about you, King? What say you? What is going on? I warned him not to do anything brash. Now look at the mess he's in. I could never face the departed queen if anything happens to her. Please hurry and save the soldiers and rescue the Princess Polly. Let's see, there was a tally at the end for items and rupees plus main objectives. The remake of Zelda 1 looks so good. Um, I, yeah, I haven't seen the remake of the, uh, the first Zelda. Oh, that's, that's good to hear that they did a good job on it. Typical royalty, a bunch of people died and even worse, she's kidnapped. <laughs> yeah. I mean... If you found out your, your daughter got kidnapped and you heard a bunch of people got killed around her too, you'd be sad about the people that got killed, but you'd also be super worried about your daughter, most importantly. <laughs> I think. I don't have kids, so I, I can't relate. But I feel like that would be the case. <laughs> right. A screenshot. Oh, nice. Yeah, sure. Oh, I could go to the garden thing now, maybe. Oh, no, it's blocked out still. Uh, there's a back room here that I could maybe go to. Oh, sweet. You have a total of 120 luck rocks. You slippers? Anything to click on? Oh, it's just for the luck rock. <laughs> oh, let's see what this is. Alright, so this is the remake. Oh man, it looks, yeah, it does look good. Like it, it still has like the, not to sound too hippie about it, but it does have like the sort of like the soul, the soul of the original. It looks kind of like a, like if Turbo Graphics did, did a version of Zelda, this, I feel like this is what it would look like. It has a Turbo Graphics feel to it. Right? Am I, am I totally wrong about that? That looks really cool. So, hold on, what is that on? I'm, I'm totally not following the, um, the remake of Zelda. Is that for Switch? Or is that like a fan thing? I guess it, most likely it's for Switch, right? Yeah, it has a little bit of a of a Turbo Graphics vibe to it, which I love. By the way, I I grew up on on the Turbo Graphics, as well as like uh, the NES and Super Nintendo. I didn't really uh, grow up on Sega. I had to pick a side. <laughs> I had to. We couldn't afford to play all sides. Let's see, it's an official mod. Oh, sweet. 
And it's a 16-bit version. Oh, wait. You're, you're saying something else. There is a Zelda like on... Yeah, Newtopia. Newtopia 1 and 2. They're fantastic games. And they stand on their own. Yeah, yeah, exactly. No, I play, I, I've beaten both of those. And uh, I love them. I love Newtopia 1 and 2. Alright, I should probably save. You never could try them? You should. Yeah. If you get a chance you should give them a shot there is like if you want to like legit play them i get you could buy like the um i mean i have the mister so i could i could play it but uh you know there's also the analog uh the turbo graphics clone basically the fpga uh turbo graphics by analog I forgot what it's called. Oh yeah, there's also the mini, but I don't know if Newtopia is on it. Um, Golden Axe Warrior isn't good for a rival game. I'm I'm planning on playing that soon, Lester Roth, because <laughs> everyone I've talked to has enjoyed Golden Axe Warrior, so. I'm going I'm going to be playing that soon. All right, we're going down the hole. Down the ant hole. Oh, dang it. I didn't mean to fall. I wonder if I could get back up there. Oh, I missed the luck rock. Can I jump up there? Aww. There, there's a rope over on the other side, so there's got to be a way to get back. Get back there. I feel bad that I missed the luck rock. I don't really need it, to be honest, but... It feels bad that I missed something. <laughs> it's all down from here. Yeah, you got that right, Kristoff. Uh, Zelda remake was for the SNES satellite thing. Oh. I see. I see now. Yeah, what's up with this soldier? H hello Nuts. No answer. <laughs> no one says nuts anymore. I'm bringing that back. I'm going to bring that back. I'm going to say nuts all the time. Instead of saying... Instead of saying b****. He's not moving. Is he dead? Hey, wait a minute. Oh, I thought he was going to get the luck rock. <laughs> Snap out of it, man. If he drinks this, he'll be fine. Is he giving him some G fuel? This drug only works on soldiers, but it will revive them. Even if they are severe severely wounded. Drink this, soldier blue. Oh, that's what it's called, Soldier Blue? That's a weird name for a thing. Oh, I'm alive. I hate to say it, but Polly fell into enemy hands. Alright, I gotta take my meds real quick. Yeah, no one has died in this game, right? I don't think so. Let's see. Oh, I'm alive. I hate to say it, but Polly fell into enemy hands. Hurry back to the castle to prepare for our next offensive. Thank you. They caught me by surprise. I need to go back now. There are still injured soldiers ahead. Let's keep going. Oh, these guys are brave. I need to see what's over here. Ah, uh, tomatoes. Alright guys. 
We made some good progress today. We completed that one quest. Um, I'm gonna have to continue this on, on Tuesday. But yeah, we made some good progress. We did, did some drawing today. It's been a good day. And it's all thanks to you guys. So thank you guys for um, making this stream great. Thanks for making streams great again. <laughs> I'm already I already regret that I said that but um thanks everyone thanks for being here um I will be back on Tuesday I'm not sure if I'm going to be changing my time the time that I go live so uh stay tuned I'll let you guys know on discord and twitter but normally I go on 7 p.m eastern time I might go on earlier so I don't know. I'm thinking about it. I'm still like trying to consider it. Because <laughs> it seems like uh, earlier might be better for me because I'm trying to like sleep earlier and stuff too. And uh, that's going to help. But anyways. Thanks you all for being here. Let's put on some music. Yeah, I'm really, really enjoying this game and having a fun time streaming this, so um, I'm glad some of you are enjoying it, and I hope all of you are. Here are my links if you guys want to know where I am on the internets. I got my my website, I do illustrations, um, and if you guys want to see that, uh, some of the stuff I do, go to tandagasa.com. I'm also on Twitter and Instagram. And uh, feel free to join my Discord, hang out, have some shenanigans, have some shenanigans with me. Shenanigans, uh, shenanigans are good. <laughs> They're fun. Let's see what we could rate today. Um, who can we send some love to? Um, I think I'm going to wait, how long has it been? Trying to see how long they've been on. I'm going to send you guys over to Phoenix Pearl. Another cool streamer. By the way, she's playing Golden Axe Warrior, which uh, someone mentioned earlier. <laughs> so I think that'd be a good transition. And she's also a great streamer and I, I, I love hanging out there. So please go over there, give her a follow if you like her content. And um, also, thank you so much for all the support today. For the, all the amazing raids, the hosts, um, the bits, the subscriptions, the, guests, the gift subs. Thank you so much for supporting me in any way you can. Especially just for being here and spending some of your Saturday with me today. Um, it was great hanging out with all of you. I hope you guys have the, the best weekend that you ever have. <laughs> have a great weekend. And uh, I hope to see you on Tuesday again, uh, 7 p.m. Eastern time normally. I might go on earlier. But um, till then, take care, stay safe, be kind to one another, guys, and I'll see you all next time. Thanks again, Lesteroth, Grizzleby, Gorker, um, GN Boston. It was good seeing you. Hey, hey, I think you snuck in here. I don't know if I saw you earlier. Joda, um, Christoph, Ruter. Rutier, I hope I'm saying that right. Ruter, Rutier. Um, yeah, thank you so much for joining me today. I'll have a good one. I will see you guys next time. Take care, everyone. Bye. Bye, guys. Thank you again. Bye.